That's a pretty move, an explosive move. Cartwright wants it. He got it. And taking batters into his own hands. Miles Cartwright, who has that kind of athleticism. What was it like for you? You're from California, you come out here. Did you fully understand and appreciate this building? When I first got here and played my first game here, it was just, was it, it, was, mean, it was amazing. Everybody's on top of yeah, you. Yeah, that's, that's the best feeling. You, just, like, you, feel, you, feel like you, you almost feel like you're in the crowd when yeah. you're playing. This is Philadelphia's home. You know, it's our home gym. We play the most home games here, but this is, this is Philadelphia's gym. Cartwright drills it. Miles Cartwright, their second leading scorer, averaging 12. They certainly need something from him. Talk to me about last year. I mean, you guys had an amazing season. It was one of the better seasons that Penn's had in a long time. Mm -hmm. And you're this close to the NCAA tournament. On the one hand, that had to be that had to be a great feeling, mm -hmm. but a little frustrating. Mm -hmm. It was it was tough. Um, you know, we didn't start off as as great as we wanted to. Yeah. Um, and then you know we just went on an amazing run with a lot of comeback wins, and you know our seniors basically carried us, and you know we got right there, beat Harvard. And, that's, you know, I mean, that's a huge yeah, accomplishment because yeah, that, that program has yeah, come a long, long definitely. way. I had the taste in my mouth. Yeah. I was practicing what I was going to do when I first got the trophy. I yeah. mean, it, I mean, it's kind of bad to say this, but we, we let our foot off the gas. And, you know, I think, you know, it hurt then and it, it still hurts, but I think it's made us all better. It motivates definitely. you for a little bit for this definitely. season, right? Do you feel like because of you know, how much pub Rosen mm -hmm. got and what a, what a quality mm -hmm. player he was, that you guys have something to prove that you, you know, you, mm -hmm. now it's your team, right? I mean, do you feel like you got to show people that you guys can can achieve without him and some of the guys that you lost? I mean, not, not really. We're not, you know, here to prove that right. we can be a great team without Zach. I mean, I don't think any of us would be the players we are without Zach. Yeah. And Zach showed us a lot in terms of work ethic and, you know, bringing it every day. And, you know, that's what we take from him. But all we want to do is just show that we're a great team this year and regardless of what happened last year. So that's all we're preparing for. But now but now it's your team. I mean, you're a captain mm -hmm. now. You had three captains mm -hmm. were named. All of them were juniors. You're one of them. Did you feel like you were ready for that responsibility? Did you know it was coming? I mean, what's it to look at this team and be like, all right, this mm -hmm. is my team now? Yeah, I mean, it's 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 a big responsibility that the coaches have placed on me and Fran and Dow. Um, to kind of lead this young group, but um, you know, all of us have to be leaders in our own way, and I don't want to put it on myself to be, you know, say it's my team because we got a lot of talented guys in that locker room, and you know, I'm I'm just excited for you know what we're gonna do as a team. It's all about growth, so change, you know, is an opportunity to grow, and, and for him, it's it's you know, being having an opportunity to step into not necessarily a new role, but to either a, show what he's what he's worked on over the summer and to you know start to start to lead, you know, because he once had to follow. The inside and oh goodness! Cartwright says it's not over yet. You literally had a highlight dunk, right? I mean people still talk to you about this. Yeah, you know which one I'm talking about, right? The one against Princeton. Yeah. I mean you threw that dunk down. It's all over it's still all over YouTube. I you know in preparation mm -hmm. to talk to you, you go and you do a little research, you mm -hmm. punch your name into Google, that dunk comes up. <laughs> That's gonna be there forever. Mm -hmm. I mean what was that like when, especially against Princeton? I mean it's mm -hmm. a big rival, right? It was I mean it was it was obviously, you know, a big play. Yeah. Um, but it was it was tough because that game was just so frustrating. Yeah. I mean we didn't play well. Um, and then we eventually lost the game. But I mean, whenever I go home, I always, you know, get a lot of people coming out to me like, man, I didn't even know you could dunk. Right after we lost to Princeton last year, you know, the guys returning, we all talked about coming back right. just to the same spot. And that's been on our mind all, all last spring and all summer and all fall. So we, we expect to win a championship. And, you know, by doing that, we got to work hard every day and you know, just continue to improve. We're young and a lot of people are already counting us out, but you know, we're just gonna use it for motivation.